airports around the world are rushing to install these thermal imaging cameras, which some say might prevent the spread of swine flu. Paul Sarapusco is with FLIR Systems, which makes these cameras. Good morning again. Good morning, Maggie. So let, our crowd is like a crowd that you might see at an airport security checkpoint. You're not going to stop everybody and take their temperature to see if they have a fever. But if you have this camera, you can do what? Absolutely. What we can do is we can look at a, a population of people coming through, perhaps through a customs or uh, immigration line. So as people walk through, what the camera can do is look at the thermal patterns of their faces. Not only look at the thermal pattern, but actually measure the temperature and try to get some type of quantitative idea. Is this person elevated versus the population of people that just came through? Okay, so let's show an example of someone who might stand out. We've given this young lady here a, a heating pad, so okay. she should... That should be detected by the camera, right? Yeah, as I pan across, you know, we're going to look at people, and as you can see, we can't look at, you know, through glasses. Mm -hmm. But as the spot jumps around the screen, as we come over, we'll find that little heating pad in her hand. And, and there it went up to 98.6. Exactly. So it, that, 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 that extreme jump is what you're looking for. Absolutely. These gross differences in temperature okay. amongst the population. So they would stop this person. They would say, where have you been? You know, they'll see if she has a fever. But they can't. If somebody has swine flu but doesn't show symptoms yet, it wouldn't never detect that. Absolutely. I mean, we're, we're again, we're looking for these temperature differentials amongst a whole crowd of people. Right. So we can do further investigation. You know, where have you been? Uh, have you been in contact with anybody who might be in contact with the swine flu? It certainly can't hurt. Absolutely not. And I'm sure you're doing very well. Abs with these cameras. Absolutely. We have over about 250 installed all around, all over the world. Here in the U.S. too. Uh, not quite in the U.S. There's some larger companies here in the U.S. that are using them in their own manufacturing plants, but from an airport perspective, you know, Bangkok, mm -hmm. Taiwan, Hong Kong, All those right. types of areas. Paul Serapusco, thank you very much for the demo. You're welcome.